Take your knee off our necks. 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 I very much support the protest. You've heard them say, defund the police. I think that's a useful demand. We're already seeing outlandish calls. Defund the police. We won't be defunding our police. We won't be dismantling our police. When I was a kid in the civil rights movement, we used to say all kinds of things to point out uh, that reform needed to happen. It's a, a call for reform. And we miss that call if we insist upon taking this call, literally. That is not what we mean. Our chapter have put out calls for defunding the police and we mean complete defunding. I just think reform is just too light. Um, minor changes aren't gonna fix this major issue. Right now, as you know, it's a lot of police officers that's out there that's not quite deserving of being paid. I don't believe those who are calling for defunding the police mean us to defund all police activity. If it's difficult to imagine a world without police to look at the wealthiest neighborhoods in the country that exist without high policing, without increased police on every block, but have all the resources that they need. Defunding the police and investing in community. So with DC, our specific demand is to invest in community-led violence interrupter program um, that we actually already have in the city that is underfunded. Well, in my own district of the nation's capital, if you were to say to the most disadvantaged wards, uh, do you really want uh, the police out? They would think I was crazy. Uh, they have been asking for more police, indeed, in those wards. The peaceful protesters rightly do not want to be lumped in with a subset of looters and rioters who seek destruction. Then the vast majority of brave police officers cannot be lumped in with the very worst examples of heinous behavior. Do you support the defund the police movement that we're seeing on the ground? I think the Congresswoman answered your question very clearly. Uh, but it, the fact is, is that we do have a great deal of legislation coming down the pike that addresses some of the concerns of our communities. So if people like me and the Congress are being observant, I think what we'd hear is stop over-relying on the police. You know, if somebody overdoses, for example, <laughs> can you really call the cops? Or isn't there another part of the government that could be more useful. Right now you have police being used as solutions for problems that uh, they are not equipped to solve. Um, we need to be investing in social workers. We need to be investing in community resilience programs. If we want to make sure that activists don't feel that they have to everlasting be in the street, I think we need to see state and city legislatures meet and begin taking action. I wonder if black skins got darker because we're close to the sun, then how many years will it take for us to